Okay, so I went and plugged it in. Uh, the only thing I did what I, uh, without showing you is I plugged in a, power, a really short power cable from the bottom board here, the uh, controller board. There's a USB port there. There's a USB port that I plugged in and you can trace it right to the Pi, the uh, power input for the Pi. So, and then there's a power in for the control board. So if you want to power it off of one supply, you have a uh, plug into the wall here. Oh yeah, uh, uh, this source. And you power up the control board. And then from the control board, you have another short cable from the USB output here to the Raspberry Pi. And I have the uh, latest uh, Raspbian uh, October of whatever, the one that just came out. Um, SD card already in. And all I did was flash the card. I just finished flashing the card. I didn't do anything else. Uh, I didn't update anything, didn't uh, configure anything or whatever. So let's just plug it in and see what happens. Uh, I don't have the uh, HDMI connector, it's supposed to boot right off of uh, the display. So you should not need anything else. I'm just gonna use a piece of thing here just to hold it up. And uh, let's see what happens when I plug it in. Uh, I got a power supply here and I'm just trying to bring it up a little closer because it's not reaching. I have two short cables here. I always use a very short cable because uh, the power, the uh, Pi is very sensitive to things, to uh, resistance. So there, I just plug it in, uh, it's flashing and I'm getting, well, it's upside down. So anyway, it's upside down, but whatever. I got four raspberries there and I'm getting serious reflection there. And oh, look at that, it's uh, everything's upside down, but the menu, bar, everything. I wonder if the touch screen works right. Oh, look at that, the touch screen works right out of the box. It's not very stable. I don't have uh, anything to stabilize it, but everything. Oh, I can even drag. So touching a point just goes there. If I just tap or whatever, it just goes there. And if I just drag it, uh, it does that and drag it. And otherwise it, it does, it, it displays some kind of icon there to hold it long. I don't know if you can see that. See, it puts that thing there. I don't know what that is. There's a little icon there that looks like a, a little I, the letter I as an igloo. You can probably see where it's, I'm dragging it there. And um, what's this thing here? I don't know what that button's for. Uh, what's that for? No ejectable devices. Uh, okay, I don't have a network plugged in. I have nothing else plugged in. I just have this display here. Um, there's no light show anywhere in the back. So there's no point in showing you. There's nothing. Well, let's just see this. There's no light show here, except for the red light from the Raspberry Pi. Uh, so there's no indication, if you have trouble, there's no indication as to what's going on with the uh, display control here. And it's upside down, I can't, I don't have the thing there. Um, so let's do a shutdown, and I don't know what else is there to see. That's the, uh, yeah. That's the latest Raspbian. Um, let's get everything upside down. Shut down. So I don't really need a keyboard or a mouse. And it just a little kinks here and there, but otherwise, uh, no. Yeah, what is that? And I'll just check back. Uh, it's not flashing anymore. So I guess it's off, right? Uh, it's got little corners here it's got this uh, corner here and uh, these light corner the uh, bright corners and it's still on 
as you can see probably that it's uh, still glowing I'll give it another a little bit I just touch the CPU I guess and the CPU feels cool to the touch so it's probably off yeah the CPU is cool so uh, I think that's it this hmm. I guess I could just unplug it now uh, well it's very easy to use it just works right out of the box okay I guess I could just unplug it um, the other question is how, how do you when it's on how do you turn how do you turn it off how do you turn off the display if you leave your pie on all the time there's no way to power off this the uh, display I guess I guess you just just gotta leave it on backlight is uh, LED backlight so I guess it's okay to leave it on but it'll just use more power but um, it makes a very nice all-in-one PC you can find a, a case uh, you're gonna need like a if you want to put it in a case you'll need a, a one of those right angle or left angle um, power plugs um, two of them you're gonna need two or or you can use one of these cables here you can use these cables to power the pie from the controller and then you'll need one right angle uh, plug which I do have but uh, it's under a pile of uh, junk here uh, it, these right angle things it looks like this guy on it just gotta you see right there I see it's uh, right angle so it's very short and uh, where did it go there it is right angle I can't take it out it's, like, it's under a pile of uh, junk there uh, but uh, what else uh, yeah it looks like I got all the connections right I could probably make my own uh, display case or whatever all right so uh, Good to go. Thanks for watching.